Off. Now, I'm going to tell you something. If real ice cream and cookies were packaged as well as Jesse James packaged these beads, I would be a lot skinnier person. <laughs> Hello, Squad. Girl. Squad. This is Monica, and I am so excited to bring this to you today. This is my first ever Jesse James Beads Ambassador Package. I have always loved Jesse James Beads, and for those of you who are not familiar with them, they're an awesome company that have a lot of cool looking components, beads and things that you can use in your jewelry making. I particularly came to them because of their large chunky beads and their kind of blingy beaded strand sets that they have. When I got started making jewelry in 2010, I was instantly drawn to Jesse James beads. I just really fell in love with the, the beaded strands that they put together and the colors and all the the unique different components in the beads. So I've been a fan and technically an ambassador of them for, you know, ever. <laughs> <laughs> unofficially an ambassador. When I teach my jewelry making classes, I always list them as one of my beading suppliers that I love to get kind of unique pieces and strands that are in certain colorways. That way, if you are at all challenged in your jewelry making design, you can already select from a wide variety of different colorways and it all looks unique even though it's similar. And of course you can change them up, mix and match and all that stuff and incorporate that into your bead stash. But it, even if you don't wanna do that and all you wanna do is just, oh, I love that strand, pop it on a bracelet or a necklace, then you're good to go. Now what's exciting is they have reactivated their Jesse James Beads Ambassador program and kind of refreshed it. I thought, well, I'm gonna put in for that. It only takes 100 subscribers or followers. You can get a sampling of their goodies once a month and they actually select them so you don't have any control over what you get. So it's a surprise and I love that. <laughs> You know, I'm always up for beating surprises. And this is also sort of akin to the to the way I get the monthly subscription boxes because I never really know exactly what I'm gonna get until I see it. And a lot of them are things I've never worked with before. So it kind of gives a little bit of interest, intrigue, and it's just something cool. But this is going to be an added layer of coolness because it's my Jesse James Beads people that I love so much. I will put a link below to them. I have an ambassador page on their website, which is so exciting. Please go check that out. And I will put my little affiliate link down there below so that if you're interested in checking out what they are selling, you can buy directly from their website now. And they also have a subscription, like a, ma a monthly box. They're calling it the Magical Mystery Bead Box. They also have a bunch of sales. Those of you that are following me on social media, you know I'm in the throes of trying to organize my dream box cabinet. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited about that. And I'm finally able to unpack my craft room boxes, y'all, after two years. <laughs> Can you tell I'm a little bit excited? So I am really just having a good time. And I thought, you know, I, I wanna kinda check out Jesse James because I haven't been on there in a while since I've not been able to make any jewelry. And I bought a bunch. I don't even know how many, I'm not even gonna tell you. I'm probably ashamed to tell you. No, I'm not ashamed. I'm never ashamed, but. <laughs> It was a lot, <laughs> suffice to say. And I have not edited that video yet because I did do like a haul of that. And that's, I don't know, that's been three months ago, I guess. I've, re I've been really busy, guys. I mean, that just kind of kick-started me. And that's what I saw on their website that they had reactivated the Ambassador program. I was so excited that they accepted me into that. They have such unique beads and components that it makes you feel like you're just this awesome artist whenever you put a design together. And really, it's in the beads and components. For the most part, I mean, you know, you can do all sorts of things in your artistry to jazz it up, of course. But I just absolutely am a fanatic about Jesse James beads. Now, for those of you who have seen my previous videos, videos and maybe you followed me around on my website and my social media, you know that I have made bracelets that are very popular with Jesse James Beads. And one of them got featured in a little coffee table book that was written and designed by Carrie Bunker and Renee Christine. And they are kind of like the handmade entrepreneur world's version of, you know, a help desk. 
I did a lot of their training to build my website and be able to do some handmade entrepreneurial type of training for myself over the years. And they created that book that had a lot of my fellow beaters and artists in there. And it was just really cool. I saw one of my little bracelets was in there and it happened to contain Jesse James beads. Let's get into my first ever Jesse James Beads Design Ambassador Kit, guys. Come on, let's do it. I'm so excited. Okay, let's go. Let's pull this out. Oh, and right off. It's blue and I love it. It's blue and fabulous. This kit was designed and packed for Monica Dockery. It includes the ice cream bead mix and Cookie Monster. Yes! This is so me. <laughs> Cage Crystal Bead in 12 millimeters Silver and Summer Fun Bead Mix in Shark Week. Yay! Thank you, Kelly. Oh, I'm so excited. I love it already and I haven't even seen it. Cookie Monster means a lot to me because in my youth, I babysat some beautiful little kitties. Not kitties like kitty cats like my babies now, <laughs> but actual human children. Yes, and I used to call them, well, I still call them that, my little cookie monsters because their last name is Cook. One of which is in his very own band, and I will put a link below to his band, the West Cook Band, and uh, you ought to check him out. He's got so, kind of a country rock vibe going with his band, and I just think that they're fabulous. They did a song that I think that it was on the I believe they were on Fox News with it, and it was called I Stand for the Flag. So, check that out. I love it. I'm so proud of them. And when I saw Cookie Monster, I thought, okay, here we go. This is meant to be. <laughs> All right, so let's get back to the unboxing, shall we? It doesn't take much to entertain me. I'm just thrilled beyond belief that I have received something from one of my favorite companies. I love it. Oh my gosh, how beautiful. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and pull it out of the plastic. First thing is the ice cream bead mix in Cookie Monster. Now that's what this is. Oh, it's got a little ice cream. Look at that. Oh, and see, cookies and ice cream, they go together. Am I right? Am I right? And they're bright blues, which of course I love blue in general, but because my brand colors are pink and blue, this is right up my alley. I was noticing their posts on Instagram about ice cream sundaes, and I know I just watched a video, on, I think it was on their YouTube channel, where a designer was making little wire cones and using the beads from the different ice cream collections that they've got to make little ice cream cones, and they were so cute. I thought, ah, oh, yes, and I actually ordered one of those wire cone gizmos. I haven't received it yet, but... <laughs> I get to make my very own little ice cream with the Cookie Monster set. Now I'm hungry. Why is that? Oh, yeah, it's because cookies and ice cream are right within my grasp. Now, I love the fact that it comes in a container. As you all know, jewelry designers can never have too many containers. We love our containers. Yes. Oh, I just love it. I've got to open this, though. I have to. I just, I cannot sit here and not open this. We've got to pull it off of the, the little thingy here. And can I turn it? Oh no, the design challenge has yet. Oh, it's taped, no wonder, okay. I think I've got all the tape off. Now I'm gonna tell you something, if real ice cream and cookies were packaged as well as Jesse James packaged these beads, I would be a lot skinnier person. <laughs> I've got it open, it looks like, yay! I have accomplished my first design feat of the day. That's, that's thrilling. Okay, so let me open this and let's look at this little charm up close and personal. Oh, look at that. How cute. Mm. I'm, I'm trying to eat metal. Is that, is that a bad thing? I don't know. Don't judge. Oh, wow. Okay, so I'm excited over a little metal charm that looks like an ice cream in blue with little pokey dots on there. Actually, I happen to have some caramel low carb, it's like keto bars, ice cream. So guess what I'm having for dessert tonight now that I've seen this, I can't pass it up. And let's just do a little light flipping through here. I'll do a full on looky loop. Ooh, look at the sparkle. Okay, we're gonna have to pull these up. I can't, oh wow. Look at that, y'all. I don't even know if I'm gonna get through this whole unboxing without just pulling everything out. <laughs> See what I mean? I mean, there's so many different shapes and cool components and things like that, not to mention the beads and colors. You don't see a lot of these things out 
and it's nice that they kind of pull everything together like these blues and silvers they pull all of it together but you can make whatever you want and you know design whatever you you feel like designing or you can use their strands like the chunky boho strands that i have which i will get to post in my video soon to show you that but i mean your possibilities are endless and i just love what they select like whoever puts these things together they're awesome there's my little ice cream cookie monster set and it says there's a hundred pieces in this little video container uh -oh. i broke in the fort knox of the ice cream container and now i can't get it closed <laughs> so there's my little cookie monster ice cream i love it okay so now this is the summer fun bead mix in shark week Ooh. Here we go. <laughs> so this is the summer fun collection. I got the Shark Week and it is blue and it coordinates so well. Look at that with my little Cookie Monster ice cream set that I got, my little mini bead mix. And let's let's open this up. Oh, wow, there are actual little shark coin beads in here. Look how pretty these are. Ooh, it's like a shell coin bead. And there's sharks on both sides. The hole goes through the center there. That's like the size of a quarter. Midnight blue and a light blue. And then the beads. Ooh, what is this? It's a little pelican. How sweet is that? And this is a hammerhead shark. <laughs> oh, this is too fun. When I go to Myrtle Beach, I'm always the one that is bent over looking for shark's teeth. <laughs> this is so up my alley, man. I love it. Oh, look at these little turtles. Whoops, that one flew out there. Look at these little turtles. Sea turtles are so cute. Some shells. Oh, and little sparkle blings here. Ooh, I love that blue. That is so beautiful. That's my color of blue right there, guys. Sparkle by Monica Blue. Here's another turtle. So we can do a lot of earrings out of this if you just wanted to do that. And oops, there's another blue. I don't know what this is, but look at that. It looks like it's acrylic, but yet it has some shell, like abalone. Look at that. It's probably a resin bead, but it has a shell look about it, like abalone, and I think that's so pretty. It's kind of like a peacock color. Oh, beautiful. I'm going to lay that up there because that's so pretty. So many nice sparkles. Ooh, you get two of those, too. Ooh. I don't think I see any more charms in there. There's some bead caps. Ooh, that's a pretty bead right there. Look at that. Oh, wow. Man, there's bunches of those. There's some teardrops. I love those. That turquoise blue color is so amazing. And this one kind of has a Aurora Borealis finish to it. That kind of rainbow effect. So there's a bunch of blues and opaque and clear and crystal and matte, silvers, squares, rounds, teardrop shapes. Woo! I'm going to be having some fun with this. Oh, wow. Yep. Man, and I think we're going to the beach in September unless this Delta variant shuts everything down again. So hopefully this time I won't get sick. The last time, last uh, February 2020, was right before the virus shut everything down. We didn't even realize it was in the States yet, which now we know it was actually in December. And I was sick the entire week that we got to the beach. So now I'm thinking I probably had the virus, but they were telling me back then it was bronchitis. So who really knows? But these are beautiful beads. Wow, look at this. This bicone, this is huge. So this is lots of blues and greens.
earrings, lots of ocean vibe here, and some cool charms to do earrings with, and bracelets and necklaces, bead caps, some sparkle, some shimmer, some matte. I'm thrilled with this. This is super exciting. Okay, so I've got my cookies and I got my ice cream. Let's see. I now have the cage crystal beads in a 12 millimeter silver. And this is something that looks good in either a bracelet or a necklace, even earrings. Really, all of these components you can do anything with. So don't ever feel like you can't do one thing and not the other because that's the beauty of beads, really. I mean, it's whatever your personal preference is, or if you make things to sell, whatever your jewelry customers want. These are so cool. The, if you put these on the end of earrings, they have a movement to it with the little crystal that's in the center, and it's not really clunky. It's light, so it won't weigh down your ears. If you want to put this in a necklace, then you can mix it, of course, with the beads here that you have and have this kind of offset or together. If you wanted to do a bracelet, you could do one as the focal and then everything around it, or you could put both of them on there and have a chunky bracelet. But at any rate, look how beautiful these are. And they're so nice and sparkly, but they also don't overpower you with the bling level. So I love that. Thank you so much, Jesse James Beads. I am so thrilled with my ice cream bead mix in the Cookie Monster and the Summer Fun bead mix in the Shark Week. I mean, you could not have picked two better suited topics for me than Cookie Monster and Shark Week. My little cookie monsters, I'm going to have to tag them in the post that I make for this. They're going to get a kick out of this. <laughs> Thank you so much to Miss Kelly at Jesse James Beads for selecting the Summer Fun Collection and this Cookie Monster Ice Cream Collection. I love these so much. I can't wait to get busy making jewelry with these two collections here and my little cage crystal beads. These are so pretty. If you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up. Share this to any of your jewelry making friends that might enjoy this. Subscribe to my channel if you've not already done so. And leave me a comment below. What is your favorite kind of ice cream? Do you like to watch Shark Week? Or are you just like me and you like to search for shark's teeth when you're at the beach? I love doing that. And shells. I love my shells. So let me know below in the comments. And as always, have a sparkle day, y'all. Bye!